In our timeline, the sauropods were the gentle architects of the Jurassic. Their immense size was fueled by vegetation. They were biological factories of peace. But the fossil record hides gaps where evolution could have taken a terrifying turn. We entered parameters for a global flora collapse in the late Jurassic. Starvation forced a desperate biological pivot. The result? Simulation 88C. The gentle giant is gone. Behold the Carnotitan. The biomechanics of this creature have been radically repurposed. The long neck, once used to reach the canopy, has evolved into a kinetic weapon. It acts like a whip or a striking cobra. They do not chase. They are ambush predators on a planetary scale. Their metabolism has spiked, requiring thousands of pounds of meat daily. The sheer calorie cost of moving this mass means they must hunt constantly. Notice the ocular placement, binocular vision. They are no longer scanning for leaves. They are triangulating prey. The forest is no longer a salad bowl. It is a hunting ground where the trees themselves have teeth. This simulation forces us to confront a chilling reality. Size does not guarantee safety, and nature has no morality. If the plants had died, the giants wouldn't have just vanished. They might have turned on us. In this world, the ground doesn't just shake, it hungers. The dossier is closed, but the simulation engine is still running warm. 